Welcome to the channel guys. In just a few minutes, I'm going to feed 10 dogs. And I want to take you along with me to show you how fun that is. Not too bad with the older ones. But then we got to feed them little hooligans. And what I have to do every, twice a day they're still eating. You don't dare go out there in shorts, I'll tell you that. They will scratch you like nuts. I have to put on a pair of pants, feed the older dogs, then go in there, which is an ordeal all itself, set the food down, dump the water, because they get their water dumped two to three times a day, and then I got to scoop poop. I promise not to show the poop, but you'll get to see the routine and how difficult they make it for me to take care of them. Now, I was in contact with the rescue today. They wanted new pictures. That was an adventure, trying to get them to hold still for pictures. So I took a bunch outside of the kennel. Nope. Get out of the sun there, guys. And uh, that wasn't good enough. <laughs> I had to go inside. And then they wanted to play, and I could not wear them down. So I finally was able to get five good pictures of them. So she's working on a transport right now, so hopefully soon. We can get them a home because it's going to get hot. I don't want them to be in there. So let's get going. They're already they're already milling around. There's T uh, Tilly. Are you are you ready? Why do you got to go drink out of the chicken's water? You got good fresh water up there in a shade shelter. Your water is in the shade. Quit drinking the chicken's water, okay? Oreo knows it's almost supper time. Are you hungry? Where's Millie? Oh, Millie's up in the... Is that a rock or is that Millie in there? It looks like a rock. Yeah, that's a rock. But it's moved. Okay. It doesn't matter where Millie is. As soon as the dinner bowls come out, she'll be over here. All right, guys, get ready. Here we go. All right, guys, I'm hoping that this won't be too bouncy. Let me get a fork here. Uh, excuse the dishes. <laughs> I've got all the bowls washed with hot soapy water. I got roosters ready. We'll go ahead. And... She eats these things. Sometimes she does. Sometimes she won't eat nothing. Sometimes in the heat, the dogs go through little changes. They may not eat a day or two. Come on, rooster. I have a very heavy camera right now so there's your supper okay but I did get my new microphones all right first thing we're gonna do is get some dog food ah, try to get a couple of these Puppies get four of these. These are equal to about two cups, I believe. They eat more in the evening, it seems. Okay, now they'll each get one of these. Yeah, this is a very bouncy chest plate with this extra weight on it, so bear with me. But that's one good thing GoPros are good for. They stabilize. All right, two more. I've done these videos before, guys. You've seen them. But things have changed a little. My routine is different. Okay, these guys are having choice cuts and gravy with beef. And just give them all an equal amount. You know, because dogs, they like a little. They get a different flavor every day. You don't want to eat the same crap every day, do you? They don't either. Ooh, somebody's getting some gravy. Get it all. Then what I'm gonna do is get a little water. That way we can I always add a little water to the puppies. So why not give them gravy water? Alright. Then we just mix it all in like such. Every morsel must be covered in gravy or Waldo will send it back. 
Ooh, that one's really gravy. I better give that one to Waldo. He will enjoy that. They're ready. Puppy food. They're having fillet mignon. <laughs> I like good fillet mignon myself. We're just going to break that up in there. You're like, just dump the can already. I like to spread it out. In the summer, the nice thing about this stuff is it's nice and mushy. In the winter, it's hard as a rock. Okay, now. I'm going to let the big dogs eat inside the apartment today because it's pretty hot. I've got their air conditioner on high. Got to get this. Got to do the same thing. Get a little morsel of meat in every, next to every bite. Okay, let's get Waldo and Lily's and go out here. Oh, this thing's way too bouncy on here. Hope you hear me better. I got the new mics in. Come on, Lily. You guys want to eat in? Here, boy. Here's yours. Here's yours, Lily. Let's put you down here because I, I got the air conditioner run on high now. She's not used to that, so she's scared of it. Here. Eat yours. There's your bowl. Okay. You shouldn't be scared of the air conditioner. You just got fresh water. Okay. Ah, it's fixing to get fun. Well, your supper's there. Your supper's there. It's out there, and you got to be hungry because you didn't eat yesterday. Because you're picky. You fill up on junk. All right, here we go. Dinner is served. We've only fed two or three. We got seven more to feed. Okay, we get these two guys set up. They're gonna see the bowls and start, the puppies will, and start going nuts. Are you scared of my camera? Yeah, I bet the puppies try to get it too. Let's go over here in the shade. It's time to mow. Right, here you go, Tilly. Let's get you out of the high grass. And there they are. Oh, the fun begins now. And I do have my pants on. Why did I shut the gate? Hopefully, uh, this camera works out all right. I got it. That ain't the best gate latch on there. That's why I got all that stuff on there. You guys got poop everywhere. Scoop you twice a day. We're having fillet mignon today. I don't think you, oh, don't think you guys have ever had it. Get back. All right, guys, it may get a little bouncy here. Get out of the way. All right, here we go, I got it. Get back, get back. No, you're not going to get the camera. Here. All right, right when I drop it, grab the old bowl. I liked it when I didn't have this screen on the top. Because I could just throw it over the fence. I can't do that. They're looking a lot better. They got their medication for their fur. It's They're about back to normal. All right, I'm going to go ahead and secure that. Go get them some water. No, I scoop. I'll keep the camera high, guys. But you can see how what goes on next. Got to scoop the poop. Got five little poopers in here. Why don't you get back? You guys need to quit knocking on each other. Your heads are all. There's more poop. You just got. Oh, they've been in here all day. Come on. Get off me. They're just all over me, making this very hard. Get, get, get. Now they see my camera. Get out of the way. Get out of the way, you little buttheads. Ah, uh, it's impossible. 
You guys are impossible. Quit chewing on my shoes. Shoelaces are the first to go. Get off the camera. That's expensive. Go eat. Go eat your food. Go on. You got to talk a little stern to them. Go eat. Come on. Now, the hard part's done. Get out of the way of my feet. Go eat. They just, I can't break them of that. Getting me. Okay. Now I gotta go dump this. If I don't, Tilly will be in it. I know, it's gross. Let me show you where I dump it. It's a uh, fertilizer. Ain't much you can do with it. This is mixed with cedar chips, uh, pine chips. So it's like compost. Hopefully the sound is a lot better than it has been, guys. I did to do a test. Let's go into there. And get on in there. I'm trying to keep this still. I got an aluminum case around the GoPro. It also has an adapter for the microphone receiver. So it's quite heavy. I'm going to leave this here because I got scooped their yard. Now, get them some fresh water and we're done. Was I starving for content? No. I wanted to do two things show you how it is to feed them and test my new microphone. Garden's looking thirsty. I should be getting some ripe tomatoes here pretty soon. Wow, look at those marigolds. Just overnight. I bet it picks up me being out of breath easier. Okay. Oh, yeah. That scared the heck out of me. Why is this leaking? It's not even on. And I do got a little scrubby there, but it ain't dirty. That shade cloth I put on there uh, really makes a difference. Keeps the water from getting the hot sun on it, so I can just leave it right outside there. I need to get them a bigger bucket. So I'll probably go do that tomorrow. I'm also going to start putting their food in two separate bowls uh, because Willie's getting aggressive that they're too big for that one little bowl and then I want to go to three bowls four bowls and eventually five bowls so I could train them to eat out of separate bowls but I may not have them that long because right now she's working on uh, getting them a transport I hope I sure hope so. All right, I got some fresh cool. Yep, dogs don't call water water. They call it cool. Fresh cold cool. Come on. All right, to the water. Drink, drink, drink. They are good, good dogs. Man, did they have a ball this morning. I went in there for a long time with them this morning. And, uh, Played. Well, I was trying to get their pictures, but we played a bunch. You can't wear these guys out, man. All right. And if it's wet out when you do this, this leash will dry, and you play hell getting this off. And I just bring it over here. That way, if they ever get the gate open, they can't open it. And I think you guys are just a few days away from even trying it. Yeah. Because you're troubles. You guys are troubles. All right. All right, guys. 
that's my day, twice a day. Well, the big dogs only get fed in the evening. Uh, that's all, all, I mean, you see none of my dogs have a weight, uh, are skinny, and some of them have a weight problem. So a lot of people overfeed their dogs, and you don't need to feed them that much. It depends on the food you're buying them. If you're buying them cheap stuff from the dollar store, you're going to have to feed them more because there's just not much nutrition in that. <laughs> so when you get a new dog, you if you've got food left over in a bowl, you're getting them too much. Dogs eat their food in one setting. So if you've got leftover food, that's, you know, like Rooster, she always has dry food ready in her bowl. That's fine. That's an indoor dog. These outdoor dogs, uh, you only give them what they need. And if there's food left, you cut back, you know, cut back till, you, till they're eating every bit of it. And in the winter, you want to increase that a little bit because dogs are going to eat more in the winter. They just, when it's hot like this, they don't want to eat much. Uh, you know, most wolves and things in the wild, they don't require the food that you think they do. So that's, you know, in case anybody was wondering or thought that wasn't much, it's plenty. Because Lily ain't, uh, she's not going to blow in the, way wind, in the wind, I'll tell you that. All right, let's test this microphone. Can you still hear me? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? What about now? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? What about with my back turned? What about with me twerking? If you ain't working, you better be twerking. All right, guys. Hope you stayed interested. Happy trails.